Hey y'all, this is Tamara. Welcome back. It's good to see you again. Glad you're watching. Today I'm making Jerome bars with graham crackers, coconut, and pecans. So this is how we make it. You're going to line a 9 by 13 baking dish with graham crackers. Set that aside and you're going to melt one stick of butter. I use, always use real butter, I never use margarine, so I recommend real butter. You're going to beat one egg, and then you're going to, first of all, you're going to add one cup of sugar and mix that into your butter. And when you do that, that's going to cool down your butter a little bit. You also want to reduce the heat on your stove. Then you're going to add one half cup of evaporated milk and your beaten egg, stirring that into your sugar and butter mixture until smooth. You're, wanting, you're going to want to let that come to a simmer, and while that's coming up to a simmer, crush another sleeve of graham crackers. You're going to have that ready to add one cup of that to your simmering butter mixture. So you're gonna add one cup of chopped pecans, one cup of coconut, and one cup of your crushed graham crackers. So you want a cup of those crumbs in there. Mix that up really well and turn the heat off of your stove. You don't want it to be cooking anymore. You don't want it to get too thick. Once that's all mixed together, you're gonna to pour that on top of your graham crackers. Once all of that is out of your pan, you're gonna smooth it out on top of the graham crackers, smoothing it out evenly. Just wanna get all that out, you don't wanna waste anything. Take a spatula and get that smooth all the way into the corners. And once you have that smoothed out, you're gonna to top that with another sleeve of graham crackers. So you're gonna use almost an entire box of graham cracker when you make this recipe. Just arrange those on top of your butter coconut mixture. And then we're gonna make the icing for the top of this. So for the icing, you're going to need one stick of softened butter, two cups of confectioner's sugar, sugar three tablespoons of evaporated milk, and one teaspoon of vanilla. You're going to mix that on low at first until it starts to become incorporated and then you're going to turn it up on high and mix it until it is smooth and maybe stop once and scrape your bowl. Make sure you have all your powdered sugar incorporated into the butter and when that is smooth you're going to Spoon it out on top of your second layer of graham crackers. Scrape your bowl really nice, get all of that icing out, and just smooth that over the top. Once you get that evenly coated over top of those graham crackers, you might want to take a few of the leftover graham cracker crumbs and just garnish the top of your Jerome bars. My dad loved this. He loves this recipe. He loves this dessert. And he's not a really big sweet fan. He doesn't eat a lot of sweets, but uh, he does love this. So once you've garnished it with your crumbs, you can take something to cut them into bars any size that you want. I cut these into squares and then again I cut the squares in half so there were just a little rectangle piece. 
I should also tell you that you might want to let these sit in the refrigerator for about an hour before cutting. So thanks for watching my video and I would love for you to subscribe to my channel, like and comment and um, let me know how you like them.